yes. That looks like a little bit of blue sky. Yes. Good morning, Bumblebee. Good morning, mountains of Austria. Oh guys, you would not believe it, but I just crashed the drone into that hill on the other side of the valley. Luckily, I can see it flashing just up there on the hill and I wasn't very high up, so I don't know, so stupid. I was doing a circle around the guest house and then into a tree. Oh, so stupid, so stupid. No good. It must have hit the tree at the front or something because, I don't know if you can see here on the camera, but the metal has completely sheared off on the gimbal. So look, it's just, yeah. Looks like it's the end for Mr. Brain. Rest in peace. So apparently we've been recording on 30 times hyperlapse for the past like I don't know how at least for the whole of yesterday every single shot is just a hyperlapse it's literally six seconds long that's our morning vlog yesterday oh, oh man <laughs> so it will be a really interesting episode to edit hey oh that's so 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 annoying and also this morning I just crashed the drone as well <sighs> so basically a massive disaster this morning the thing is, normally we promise ourselves when we get into a room, we just upload the footage and we check the footage. But yesterday, because we were so cold and was so cold, we didn't do it. And yeah, a big, big disaster. If you spend the whole day like filming and explaining things to the camera and then it doesn't work out. So yeah, another lesson for us just to check the footage. 36 and a half, so that can definitely go up. That is fast. Thanks so much Lexin for this awesome tire pump. Really, it's amazing. It's really, really good. So 42 in the back and 38 in the front. 38, perfect. My jumper is wet. My boots are wet, so I'm really not looking forward to step into them, but you know, we have to do what we have to do. Oh no. Oh. Oh. That's cold. <laughs> Let's hope there is a little bit sun today that we can dry off. Okay, the one thing that's going to save this morning is if Bumblebee will start without any problem. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Yes! Ah, okay. Hopefully this is the start of more good things to come today. Look at my breath. Old morning. Ready to rock and roll? Yep. Okay. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our Guinness World Record attempt to become the youngest pair to circumnavigate the globe by motorcycle. We're here in the small village of Unteregg in Austria. This is where I crashed the drone this morning. Just, uh, just up that hill there into one of those lovely pine trees right there yeah i mean to navigate the drone through a valley like this here where the hills are so high up and so steep it's, it's quite hard hey i didn't even think i was that far back to be able to hit the edge of the hill but look how picturesque hey wow ah, beautiful beautiful yeah. but yeah a little bit drama this morning with the drone and also finding out that we didn't shoot like anything with the front camera yesterday yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the first time it's happened though you would have thought we would have learnt 
always check the footage at the end of the day, make sure everything is good for the next day, but I can tell you it has happened before. And what's really interesting is the only times that it doesn't work is when we don't check it the day before. <laughs> with the audio, with the video, there's always something that meant like we should have checked it. Yeah, exactly. So guys, if you want to do more to vlog, please do yourself a favor and always check your footage. <laughs> yeah, so now actually uh, we have both of our drones out of action. Unless like somebody's really kind and gifts us one on the way, then um, <laughs> we may have no more drone shots for the rest of the trip. So this is the little village of Stackler. These Austrian villages are just absolutely so, so picturesque, so yes, beautiful. They have the biggest houses here in the world. Yeah, Look these... at this house here! <laughs> Yeah, absolutely massive <laughs> guest houses. Like I said yesterday already, this was the most expensive room we ever stayed in, but it was the cheapest room in this area here. So we paid 75 euros for one night, which is about 66 pounds. Yeah, I didn't realize that the prices in Europe were so high. I don't know if they've gone up since we left, but I remember in France, we were still getting rooms for like 35 euro or 30 euro. Yeah, yeah. And then suddenly we come to here and suddenly it's like 70 euro i think austria is particularly expensive and actually we were thinking about wild camping yesterday night but after this rain for 10 hours we said okay no we have to spend the money we have to get some energy that we can ride today yeah we have an awesome ride coming up and another new country to explore <laughs> so let me show you guys where we're heading today so we are here and today we are crossing another border because we are heading into Germany and towards the city of Munich. We cross into Germany today! Yes! Yes! <laughs> I'm so, so happy. I mean, to be honest, I spoke already German with our host we just stayed at and she was already talking German to me and it was so nice. <laughs> but yeah, I'm super excited to go to Germany. I'm super excited to see my friend today, this evening. I haven't seen her in over 10 years. We met when we were working together in Egypt when I was like 20 years old. I was going to Egypt for one year uh, to work there. And yeah, I know her from this uh, amazing time and I can't believe that we will visit her today. So we will be staying with her for the next two days, I think. Yeah, and she lives in Munich. She lives uh, the, in the suburbs of Munich, yes. It's about 120 miles and Google Maps says it will take us three and a half hours. It's already 10.15, so better hit the road, let's go. Forty-four thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine point nine. We just hit forty-five thousand miles on the road. Woo! Welcome to Innsbruck. Nice. Look at this looks beautiful here hey that's an amazing church right here look at that wow wow and look this building is like entirely covered by ivy wow nice look at this that house a nice kirche here <laughs> Did I say it right? Yes. <laughs> and look at the painting on this house here. Look at that. Wow. Really pretty. Really pretty. 
I just want to be like inside all of these restaurants. Mm, they look cozy. Yeah, they look so cozy. On a cold day like today. Look, beautiful. Oh, I can't believe how nice a day it is today compared to yesterday. Yeah, it's like day and night, hey? Oh, it's just so nice. We've just got this sunshine behind us. Yeah. Blue skies. I told you, things are going to get better after this morning. Your Is indicators are on. <laughs> no way! Yes. Oh, it's because I've trained myself out of pressing it anymore <laughs> because everybody was like commenting like oh you're pressing the indicator all the time <laughs> and now I'm like never press the indicator button anymore not <laughs> even when I have to <laughs> no now I just leave it all the time on anyway so far very 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 beautiful ride can't complain at all now Austria is the land of mountains the land of massive valleys with trees ready to crash drones into <laughs> Yeah, and cyclists as well. We have seen so many cyclists here. Yeah, but I'm not too jealous, to be honest. <laughs> not, not in a country like this. No, it's crazy, hey? I'll do a bicycle tour in Holland. Wow, look at this here. Look at this. This is some crazy mountains up ahead. Yeah. Amazing. Look at this cute little shop, Grenz Kiosk. Käse und Speckalm. Nice. Hi. Got all these stuffed animals here. Look at this. Wow. Look at these witches' hats. I've got like big Hansel and Gretel vibes right now. <laughs> Whoa, look at this meat and cheese. Thank you, thank you, Sean. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Perfect. Auf Wiedersehen. Cool. Oh, beautiful. Look at this sunshine. Oh, it's time to try and dry out our boots, eh? A little bit. Yeah. We got really told off just now. The lady was like, oh, you're feeling like home here with all your stuff drying off. I'm like, okay, we're leaving. <laughs> oh, I think we're going across here. Oh, cool. Oh yeah, look at this. Wow. Beautiful. It's like a biker hangout there. Cool. Yeah, cool. So we just checked the map and we realized that we've already crossed into Germany! <laughs> but we did not see any border anywhere. No, nothing! But then suddenly Lavi was like, oh, I think we're in Germany. Yeah. There you go. Welcome to Germany. Yes. So we're just coming into a town called Bad Tolz. Bad Tolz. <laughs> Bad Tolz. Yes. Which means? Um, something with a bath. <laughs> oh, there's an Aldi. Our good old friend, Aldi. Aldi! <laughs> First stop in Germany, Aldi. Yeah, anyway, because we got told off by this lady, we were like, okay, let's look for another place where we can have a little bit of a break. Yeah, yeah, so let's just have a break here. Yeah. Where no one can tell us to move. Exactly. And also, I will get a SIM card now. I think they have a good, good deal at Aldi. Yeah, if we can get a SIM card now that will work for the whole of Europe, then that should do us until we get back to England. Yep. Five minutes later. That's a good deal. 10 euro for the SIM card with 10 euro credit on it. I like Aldi. <laughs> Home away from home, hey? <laughs> hey, we've got these camping chairs. We're going to damn well set them up. <laughs> Would you look at that? Cheese and bread, socks drying in the sun. It doesn't get better than that. Germany! 
Yes, it's getting easier and easier now, isn't it? But look, we arrived in Germany and, and all the mountains disappeared. <laughs> What happened to the Alps? I have no idea, gone. Oh. Austria didn't give you your share, eh? Not really, eh? No, you got the bad end of the stick. And the nice houses that disappeared as well. Yeah, but now it's just Germany, Netherlands, Belgium and France. And then we're in England. Can you believe it? It's getting easier and easier. I mean, now it's like a stroll in the park, you know? It's just a holiday now. Yeah. <laughs> We've just got to hope that the weather holds at least for the next couple of weeks so that we can get back to England without suffering too much. Yeah. I don't want too many days like yesterday, I tell you. Uh-huh. So we have one hour now to reach Miriam's place in Munich. And I absolutely can't wait. And first time on the German uh, Autobahn for Bumblebee. <laughs> I'm excited, but I'm also a little bit scared. <laughs> well, it's not that far. It's eight miles. Just eight miles, just a short eight mile stretch, but yes. oh my goodness. <laughs> so this is really the road with no speed limits. Yeah. Like literally any speed goes here. Oh, well at the moment, I think they have a speed limit on there. You can see on the bridge. What? It's 120. Oh, I didn't come on the autobahn uh -huh. to be restricted to 120. <laughs> Boring. <laughs> Boring. Oh my God, these cars are going so fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you can get some distance done on here, that's for sure. Okay, we are nearly here. In Kirchheim. In Kirchheim. So apparently it is in this street. Okay. Alfonsoaza. Num number eight, no? Number eight. Four. Uh, yep. Nine. Okay, that'll do. Cool. <sighs> there we go. We've made it. Ach, ich liebe euch! <laughs> Our home on two wheels? The big motor. Yes. <laughs> geil, geil, geil. Sometimes uh, I have my own bike. Oh, cool. And sometimes, so the last time... Scotland. In Scotland? Yeah, Scotland, yeah, yeah, yeah. We make a cruise there. Oh, really cool. And uh, so we are both on one, but it yeah. was a yeah. hard <laughs> ass time. Oh, okay. Did you go from here to all the way to Scotland? <coughs> yes. Wow, well, yeah, that's yes, cool. Yes. Yeah, nice. Good evening, guys. We made it. Happy the life. Yeah, sunshine for the whole ride. It was a totally different day from yesterday, and I'm really happy about that. And I'm really happy about being here. Miriam will cook us some really amazing food now. I can't wait. And it's so amazing just to have the company and to chill out a few days here. That's it from us today. We hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and family, comment below, and we will see you next time.